Greetings family, back with another video, and well we lost another one of our brothers and sisters to legalized lynching. Um, I'll just be quick with this story, um, Sandra Bland was a sister's name and she was driving from Illinois down to Texas to start a new job and she got pulled over and the police say that during the course of this traffic stop she was combative and that obviously required them to use force and slam her into the pavement and take her into custody um, while in custody um, over that weekend they came in about 9 a.m. Um, that morning a couple days later and found her dead in the in the cell and they're saying that it was suicide that she uh, by asphyxiation is what they're saying um, of course the family quite naturally is saying that she did not kill herself and that um, they think the foul play was involved Inter interestingly enough there was videotape there's videotape of the actual uh, stop and in said tape it does not look like she's being combative but what you can hear is her screaming and asking why are you doing this I'm paraphrasing of course but you know normally I don't do these kind of videos um, I've read about two of these, two more of these such stories in the past 24 hours, not even. And it is so true what uh, Tariq Nasheed says that we are really just one traffic stop away from being a hashtag. And quite honestly, what are we going to do about this? This is continuously happening. You know, I mean, these stories are coming out on almost a daily basis, and it's really, it's saddening, it's its maddening. You know, at some point, we are going to have to do something. What that may entail, I am not 100% sure. Um, do we perhaps need to start policing ourselves, maybe um, ensuring and defending our own communities and not even calling uh, them in, perhaps? Perhaps that is one road that we should go down, should. If the system is not working for us, we need to either perhaps figure out how to control that system or create one that does. Um, because this is happening too much. You know, we're every day, we're losing. You know, that, these, are, these are people's fathers and mothers and sons and, and daughters and and they're being killed and and I don't want anyone to come in here in, in this page and say oh what happens to other groups too I don't no not at the rate that it that it happens to us if at all no this is happening at a ridiculous scale to the point it's almost once a week and it's really it's just you know I'm just I'm, I'm just really at a loss for words right now, you know, I'm, I don't know. We, we've got to do something. No one wants to say this, and protesting and marching is not working. Doing that for 40 years and it's not really working. We got to figure out something else. But that's been this bit of Truth Will Rise news, sad edition. Um, we'll be back with more stories. Um, more things real soon. Peace.